We're only a few days away from seeing the best meteor shower of the year, but that's not the only phenomenon we can see in our night sky this month. Meteorologist Danielle Giuliano spoke with NASA for advice on the best view of this rare event. For the first time in 800 years, you'll have a better chance to see the rare Christmas star in the sky. It's because Jupiter and Saturn will be close enough together. They will appear to be one. Now this happens every 20 years, but it will be more visible this time. Mark your calendars for December 21st. The beautiful thing about this is that some of these objects are naked eye objects. Jim Gilletic is the deputy project manager for the Hubble Telescope, which is famous for capturing beautiful images of our galaxies. Taken uh, one and a half million observations of the sky. Now it's your turn to see for yourself. If you're not sure where to look, smartphones have apps you can download where you point your phone at the night sky and it helps identify the stars. You really have to turn down the brightness on your phone as much as you can so that that way it doesn't bother you trying to pick out these dim objects. A tip if you have to use your iPhone is to put it in red mode. All you have to go is go into your settings, click on accessibility, then click on display and text size. You can go down and click on color filters. Mine is off currently. Once you hit the on switch there, it should automatically go to color tint, turning your screen red. Make sure your intensity and hue are all the way up. You'll be able to see the rare Christmas star with the naked eye, but you can use binoculars to get an even closer look. However, you have to make sure they are placed on a steady surface. It won't happen again for another 20 years, so you won't want to miss it. Danielle Giuliano, Channel 4, the local station. The other event to watch for is a meteor shower this Sunday night. If you need some help on where to look in the night sky, just look for this story on newsforjax.com.